Hi. Welcome to our channel. Today we are going to understand punctuation marks. Punctuation marks are important because these marks express the intended meaning of the sentence. There are 14 punctuation marks that are commonly used in English grammar. We shall study these one by one. So, today we are going to learn about comma. The comma is useful in a sentence when the writer wishes to pause before proceeding. Add a phrase that does not contain any new subject. Separate items on a list. Use more than one adjective, a describing word, like beautiful. For example, in the following sentence the phrase or clause between the commas gives us more information behind the actions of the boy, the subject of the sentence, the boy, who knew that his mother was about to arrive, ran quickly towards the opening door. Note that if the phrase or clause were to be removed, the sentence would still make sense although there would be a loss of information. Alternatively, two sentences could be used in this way, the boy ran quickly towards the opening door. He knew that his mother was about to arrive. Commas are also used to separate items in a list. For example, the shopping trolley was loaded high with bottles of beer, fruit, vegetables, toilet rolls, cereals, and cartons of milk. Note that in a list, the final two items are linked by the word and rather than by a comma. Commas are used to separate adjectives. For example, the boy was happy, eager, and full of anticipation at the start of his summer holiday. As commas represent a pause, it is good practice to read your writing out loud and listen to where you make natural pauses as you read it. More often than not, you will indicate where a comma should be placed by a natural pause. Although, the rules of where a comma needs to be placed should also be followed. So, that was all about commas, in some other video we shall discuss other punctuation marks. Stay tuned. Stay safe. Thank you.